Uh, Madam Speaker, I'm getting tired of listening to the Conservatives talk down Canadians and the Canadian economy. They should be getting to work to support Canadians in their time of need. We've made efforts through this pandemic to make sure that families could continue to put food on the table and keep a roof over their heads. We made efforts to make sure businesses could keep their doors open and the lights on. Every step of the way, they have opposed these measures. We're going to be there for Canadians in their time of need because it's the right thing to do. The Conservative strategy to combat inflation is to take more money away from families. We will be there for them in the time of need, no matter what it takes. I won't take advice from the guy who broke the immigration system. And after eight years, the Liberals continue to deny any responsibility for the Liberal inflation that they caused, causing all the pain on Canadians. But you know what? There's a list of random Liberals who prove that they are responsible. <laughs> Tiff Macklem, who said inflation is homegrown. Mark Carney said inflation is a domestic issue. Bill Morneau admitted that the Liberals overspent. Even former Liberal Finance Minister John Manley said Liberal spending is fueling inflation. So should we, play, should we believe these random Liberals that continue to say that everything is rosy and fine? Or should, we believe, or should we believe the other random liberals who say it's their fault for causing inflation? Yeah. Yeah. The 